everyone, it's the English Sinner here and welcome back to the Youngins. So in this part we are gonna get Paxton and Marisol engaged. However, before we do that, I do want to play as the boys a little bit because I actually want, un up until like 5pm when Marisol actually gets home from work, I want Kai to head out and try out the new climbing equipment. So Kai's really into like his fitness and meditation and yoga. So we're actually hopefully going to invite Nina out if we can because she's really into it as well. And I kind of want her to get like to be his training buddy. So we're going to invite Nina. Does he know Nina? He definitely should. Let me double check whether he does actually know her. Where will she be? Alexi. I mean, if he knows Alexi, he should know Nina. Or maybe not. That's a bit weird. I thought he would definitely know Nina. How very strange. I can't even remember Nina's last name. Oh, man. Nina, why are you like this? Oh, she'll be on Nathan's, though. Right, where's Nina on here? Friends, Nina Mondragon. I kn before I even looked, her name came back to me. It's Mondragon. So what I'm gonna do is a cheeky little testing cheats on, and then I'm gonna modify relationship. Kai, Snow, Nina Mondragon. And then we'll add like 60 friendship. There we go. So they just became good friends. See, that cheat is so flippin' handy. And Kai, why don't you... Well, Nathan should probably get ready for the day first, to be honest, because he has work. So we're going to go use the toilet, take a shower, all of that good stuff. Is this yours? Did you not finish eating it? I don't know why you would just stop eating that, but... Oh, well. Oh, man, we have, like, um bugs and everything. I actually might get rid of the grody, grouty, however you pronounce that word, trait, just because they they constantly are feeling nauseous. So I think instead we are going to go for um, child's play. No, we don't need that. I don't know what else to go for. What do gnomes do? Broken things just seem to get mended overnight. Hmm. To be fair, that could be quite good. What's gremlins? Stuff breaks here a lot. It's like there are tiny goblins who come out at night and smash things. Oh, let's go for gremlins. I still want something kind of negative because it is meant to be a very dark and dingy apartment that the boys can like only just afford. I mean, Kai's still not in work. I probably will get him a job. Um, it's just for, like for the time being, I kind of like him not having a job. So why don't you, oh, you're too uncomfortable to do that. Well, hopefully that will go away soon. But um, yeah, I want him to continue with that. And I am definitely, oh, he's just going to throw up in the middle of the floor. Nice. Uh, it had like maggots in it. That was disgusting. Right, now you can go continue. Oh, Nathan's out of the shower. Well, then you can go get a shower. Take a shower. Nathan's looking all good. He's actually looking really good. With his, with this hairstyle, I really like Nathan with this hairstyle. I think it really freaking suits him. Um... Shout forbidden words. Because he fell on his ass. He's like, God damn it. <laughs> that is so funny. I love how he can do that if he falls on his bum. Right, you can go continue to eat that. Are you in work today? I feel like you probably are. Yeah, nine till six. So I am just going to send him to work. He hopefully should get a promotion today. Um, he's doing pretty well in his career, so hopefully he'll be able to get one. But then, Kai, we are going to have you head on over to the gym, buddy. Probably stay there for a little bit. We might do something else during the day. Might go visit a park or something like that. I definitely need to change up the neighbourhoods, like, quite a lot. Like, I need to get better, um, 
what's it called like community lots around and stuff and definitely just give like all the worlds a change around because they're still pretty much the same as they were in the original Jungen so I kind of want to like change a couple of things up and stuff but there we go he's gone to the toilet can you flush it and please wash your hands because he's a slob he never does any of that oh Freya's out here she's just just chilling oh we should probably pay our rent too I mean, it's all of Nathan's money that's going on our rent. Kai's not really making an income right now, so all our money is just Nathan's. <laughs> Poor Kai. And I think we're gonna head on over. Hopefully we can invite Nina out. Oh, no, not you. Um, let's... I don't want to invite a club. Can we invite her to hang out a current lot and then kind of like add her to our group? Hopefully. Why did he, why did he just get in bed? Nathan, what are you doing? Um, hopefully she'll come over. We're gonna send him alone. Did that say? Yes. Nina will be right over. Hopefully she will. Do not disappoint me, Nina. I will not be impressed if this part doesn't go my way because it never ever seems to go my way. We also kind of need to uh, clean up our bar a little bit because it is gross. I feel like she's gonna like spawn down here. I feel like they always do. We have Penny over here. Uh, we got this guy who we actually do need to become friends with. And this woman as well, I think was one of your guys' creations. So we need to kind of become friends with her too. Oh, hit hey, Nina's here, cool. Um, Let's give her a funny intro because obviously we aren't technically friends with her yet yes i know there are bugs i just can't be asked moving like all of these plants to clear those bugs away so i'm just gonna leave the bugs <laughs> as bad as that sounds okay so we should do that right through the door such a good way um and then more choices actions add to group Okay, so she's now part of our group and we're gonna head out to the new climbing gym because I definitely want to see like Kai in action on the climbing. I want his sky skyming? I want his climbing skill to be quite high. I feel like he probably would do this. It is a, f um, a hidden skill as well. So it doesn't just go off your fitness. So we have the vital climb gym which I think was made by Maxis. It was just on their like Maxis curated page. I think it is made by them. I think it's like the one that Maxis created to show off fitness stuff. So we will be heading here. Sorry guys, I have a headache at the moment. I was actually going to record two videos tonight because I couldn't record one yesterday because I was dying a slow death of a hangover and... I just don't drink guys. I mean yesterday was like my breaking point I'm never gonna drink that much again in my life because I just felt awful all day And I'm fairly sure I gave myself alcohol poisoning and it was just stupid of me Just don't drink like and if you do make sure you know what you can handle and stuff I just got stupid and it killed me for like a day Um, right, let's do We can reset the record time um oh we can't even do that he just needs to right let's climb a vertical incline no i don't want you on there why can't you use it climb a vertical incline go on oh harry's over here i was wondering harry's like a little beefcake i mean a big beefcake he's not even little anymore he's like proper big now nowadays but he's still not good. I can't believe we're not friends with Harry. I feel like we definitely need to become close friends to him because he's like our cousin and actually he's our uncle. No? I don't know. I think he's our uncle, maybe? Did Haley just walk in as well? Holy crap, we've got like the whole family here. But yeah, we really need to like become friendly with him because I feel like Harry and Nathan. Oh, look, Haley and Nina are chatting to one another. That is so cute, my little babies. <laughs> Haley's adorable. So is Nina. I freaking love Nina. She's such a badass. I freaking love her so much. And I really do want her and Kai to be quite good friends because I feel like they have definitely the same kind of interest. Kai's actually doing pretty well at this. Like, 
He's not falling too much. I'm quite impressed at his climbing skill. Oh, I say that as he falls right on his back. Oh my goodness. He wants to shout. Oh, and head just fell as well. Holy crap. Harry is now taking his anger out on the punching bag. But yeah, we definitely need to become better friends with Harvey. Not Harvey, Harry. Ah, Harvey's our dad. Oh, Kai. Be careful, dude. You're gonna like really seriously hurt your back. I need to turn off. No, don't save. I need to turn off my online because it's just gonna slow my game down. There we go. Now you can continue. <laughs> I just love how the girls are just proper having a chat together. That is so cute. He's gonna do some mind concentrating. Go on, Kai. You, you get that done. Cause he's feeling tense. He's like, no, I'm gonna do some yoga. I'm gonna chill myself out a bit more. So that's good. But I do want to kind of like introduce ourselves to Harry. We could grab some food whilst we're here as well, which is good. He wants to try to calm himself down. Dude, you're fine. You're doing your yoga. Your yoga? Your yoga. <laughs> you're doing your yoga. You'll be fine. He's like proper trying to calm himself down. <laughs> Bless him. You're fine. Right, go talk to Harry. Um, What should we do? Let's discuss the latest games and we'll show off our muscles. Flatter him? I don't know. What are we meant to do to like our uncle? Uh get to know him a bit and we've not spoke to him in ages oh the whole gang's here chloe's just arrived harry just proper watched chloe walk in you can't do that anymore harry she's over you you were just like a little schoolboy crush she definitely isn't interested in you any longer bless you i i mean i feel like harry probably has moved on Especially now that Chloe's back with Jared and they're like back together for good. So hopefully he's got over her. I mean, I would be very like, I would feel sorry for Harry if he did still have like a hold up on her. Cause I just think he needs to get over her a little bit. I mean, he's a fully grown man now. He goes to the gym like clearly quite often. He can find a good girl for him. Let's have a deep conversation with him. But yeah, I really want them to become good friends. I feel like he could definitely hang out in San Maishuno with... Oh, Lacey's over here as well. Harvey's over here. Holy crap. The whole Snow family is around. Somehow, the whole family is just here. That's so funny. Oh my goodness, and Hazel is here. What the hell? Literally, the whole freaking Youngun's one. Ted's here. That's hilarious. Right, let's go chat to Nina, because we did come here with her. So let's um, work out push the limits with Nina. So he's going to work out here, I think. And we'll probably talk to her. Discourage? That's so mean. We aren't going to do that. Uh, it's Yumi. I can't get you out of my mind lately. Want to go out on a date and get some lunch at Urban Garden? I mean, we are feeling pretty hungry, but I kind of don't want to go on a date with Izumi. I feel like that was kind of like a one-time thing and it ain't gonna happen again. So I'm gonna say no to that as much as I kind of would like, I don't know. I just feel like she's, she's definitely not the one for Kai. So we are gonna say no. Oh, what's Haley doing? She's gonna come over and chat with us. Are you the trainer? Mizuki. Yes, you are. Okay, so Haley just came over and started chatting to us. Um, let's give her a pep talk. And we'll also... We can invite Haley to stretch. Let's have a deep conversation with her. Like catch up with Auntie Haley, as you do. Deep conversation. Nina just kind of, like, completely... Just didn't talk to us. She just completely ditched us. She just walked away. Can we go work out here with Nina? No. I thought, like, someone could hold this while she boxed it, but I don't think you can. Um, but yeah, it's 2pm, so we might go out for, like, I don't know. We might go out for a lunch with Nina? I kind of just want them to be really good friends. Obviously, I don't want anything to happen between them, just because 
like Nina is quite old in a sense in comparison to Kai. So I kind of don't want them, like, I feel like that would be a bit weird, going out with, like, your auntie's best mate. But I do want them to be friends, because I feel like they have a lot in common with one another. So I reckon we'll go for a little lunch date, but not a date in that way. Um, let's go to Urban Garden. Hopefully we don't bump into whatever that chick was called. <laughs> I really hope we don't bump into her now, because we totally just turned her down for a date, and... It'll be really freaking awkward if, like, she just sees us with Nina and she's like, oh, so that's why you didn't come for a date. Plus, also, she is a vampire, so I reckon she can get kind of scary. When she's angry, she can probably get, like, super creepy. And she might come and, like, suck Kai's blood or something in the night. So we kind of don't want to piss her off because I feel like a pissed off vampire just is not what anybody needs in life whatsoever okay here we go we're at the restaurant kai's actually oh, i was about gray. to say kai's actually <laughs> dressed pretty fancy for kai i mean it is at least he's got a shirt on and shoes as well uh so let's go request a table and see what we got going here oh jared's here hey dude who are you dining with today I mean, you better not be dining with anyone but Chloe. She's the one for you now. You decided it. You chose it. So you got to live with your choices. I definitely want to uh, move the story along with Chloe and Jared. That's going to be interesting to uh, see what happens. But yeah, like I said, at probably 5 p.m. we will head on over to play as Paxton and Marisol. I don't know where I'm going to have them propose, but we will have them propose to one another. Uh, Nina's decided that she wants to sit there. Here's your table. Thank you. Oh. Is this a two uh, Did we not travel as a group? Sit together. Oh. Is she not in our group anymore? I'm confused. Actions. Okay, she. I think she still is in our group. Uh, let's order for our table. So you are. And what should we order? I don't even know. I feel like they'd both get a water, and then we will go for. Um, let's go for the salmon. Yeah. Wait, is Nina a vegetarian? I don't know. I feel like she might be. I don't think she has like the veggie trait because that came out after Youngins. But I feel like I kind of made her as a veggie. I can't remember. So for the fact that I think she might be, I am going to give her... Um, we'll go for a veggie burger. Sure. There we go. 23 simoleons. That's not bad. For a meal for two... 23 simoleons is all right. I mean, I'm quite impressed with that. He's going to sit and practice his singing. Thank you. We'll bring your order out as soon as it's ready. Where the hell's Nina gone again? She just keeps walking off. Why? Why are you over there? I'm trying to, like, sing to you. <laughs> oh, I like Kai's singing voice. He's pretty good. Oh, you agree. I like how he's like, oh, thank you. <laughs> like, he totally just agreed with me that he's actually a pretty good singer. That's funny. Kai, you missed her. Oh, a little bit full of yourself. But, I mean, I think you're allowed to be. Right. Nina is clearly not coming to join us. I feel, I feel like she just doesn't want to hang out with us. Maybe it's a little bit weird to for her like a little bit too weird maybe she's just not feeling us maybe she's a bit like i don't know what Haley would say about this i feel like it's a bit strange to be like out with her nephew but yeah he just got dirty dishes it is pants where have you been hiding those mister right go sit back down together hopefully he'll just like leave those yep just leave them on the floor that's fine you can do that I mean, it's not us that's going to be tidying it up. Right, let's get a conversation going. Let's not ask for a small loan. But here we go. Our food has arrived now. Here's your order. Enjoy. Thanks very much. I mean, we definitely didn't talk at all because she went to get, like, 
a glass of water or something. But let's brighten her day a bit and we will also uh, have a deep conversation with her. See, I told you we wouldn't be the ones to clean it up. Oh, it's 5 p.m. I feel like I'm gonna leave these two to it and uh, we will, yeah, we'll head on over to Paxton and Marisol. So let's save this and I'll be back with you guys in a second. All right, guys, so we're at the park with these two and Mrs. Marisol, actually, whilst I haven't been playing her, has apparently been flirting with Ar Arush? Ar Arush? I think that's how you pronounce it. But yes, been flirting with him. So hopefully nothing comes of that. I mean, that would be very freaking awkward, but she's just gonna flirt with Paxton, which is fine. Oh, Nina's clearly left the restaurant because she just walked past us. Um, right, let's more choices. Oh, we're clicking on ourselves. Um, let's express our fondness and we will also, well, we'll caress his cheek. And I think we want to go over to the water. We want kind of, um, kind of a romantic setting. Are these two in a group? Yes, they are. Okay, so I think we're going to go down to the riverside. Here we go, over here. And we'll both head on over here together. And we're going to have Paxton <laughs> propose to Lil Marisol. I'm very excited. I feel like this has been a long time coming. To be fair, they have two, like, they have the twins together. So they're like a match made in heaven. I do really, really love them. Also, one of you guys, in the last part, I had um kai go babysit the boys and i was like oh yeah like he'll be the cool, cool uncle and then one of you guys was like wait isn't nathan technically their uncle as well because he's marisol's half brother i was like that is so true like i always forget that um he's actually kind of related to marisol it's crazy so hopefully yep here we go he's here as well let's flirt and we will embrace her and we can express fondness i actually need to get that friendship up a little bit more and where is it Propose. go on paxton the time has come my friend this is gonna be so cute oh my goodness go on paxton yay Oh, and she said yes, that makes my heart so happy. <gasps> my little babies. Oh, look at them. She's so happy. <gasps> oh my goodness. Yes, they're gonna get married. Um, but yeah, we do kind of need to um, get more friendly with one another because apparently we aren't that great of friends. I mean, we are, but not like super, like, hi so i think we're gonna cloud gaze a little bit and as those two are off cloud gazing we're gonna have a peek around we're gonna see who's here i saw ivy here a second ago talking like to some weird man in a flower crown so hopefully our niece is okay or a cousin yeah our cousin um she is Haley's little one so she would be paxton's cousin but yeah she was she's just chilling down here like in the dirt playing with a toy she's so cute oh why is she crying she's just proper out here like chatting to herself paxton just got engaged to marisol how cute oh my goodness she's adorable like i forgot how cute ivy was she's so sweet i love her in her little glasses She's absolutely loving life and he is feeling very inspired. I bet you are. I mean, you're very close to the water here. I don't know if I trust that. You're like on a slope almost going into the water. But guys, I think I'm going to end this part here just because my head is killing. Um, tomorrow, hopefully pets and parenthood will be going up. And then I'll be uploading on Monday as well to make up for the fact that I didn't upload yesterday. So videos will be back to normal from now. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Leave your comments what you would like to see in the next couple of parts obviously these two are engaged now so we're gonna leave it a little bit until they get married but one of you was like you best not 
you best not sting out on me. I want this wedding to be everyone getting back together. Don't worry, it will be. We'll go for a big wedding where we can invite like all the old Youngans. And it's not gonna be like the original wedding in Youngans. I don't think anybody is gonna run out in this one. Hopefully not anyway, fingers crossed. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will speak to you all in the next part. Bye guys.